am Webb, I'm the uh, head coach here at Sittingbourne Youth Academy. Um, this is the uh, first year we've had this programme running. Um, I've been involved with it from the start. Uh, it's a great um, opportunity for the lads to educate themselves and be involved in football. Um, obviously with a compulsory six hours training a week plus playing in the um, Youth Conference League which is the top league you can play in apart from the professional league. It's a really good opportunity for them to progress themselves both as athletes and academically. Also we have a great link with Sittingbourne First Team which is given a few boys the opportunity to go down and train with the first team and also be involved with them during match days which has been a great experience for the lads and definitely improved their understanding of what it takes to play football at that level. Um, also being involved here at Sittingbourne we have great facilities, the 3G Astro which is a great um, training facility for the boys to use. Um, we have indoor facilities, gym and indoor hall that we can both use and obviously all our home fixtures are played at Sittingbourne FC which again is another good experience to play on a pitch with a stadium and stuff like that and being involved in the Youth Conference League to play against a lot of other good teams at other good grounds so it's a great opportunity for that. Also there's opportunity in cup competitions, hopefully the FA Youth Cup which if you do progress could mean you could end up playing against a professional team. So again another great opportunity you may have as a player. My name is AJ, I'm the captain and I also play centre half or fullback. Uh, the reason I joined this academy was to get uh, both the football in and the uh, academic uh, levels of experience out of it and one day maybe forcing, force my way into the first team and if not that then I've got something to fall back on if I wanted to go into uni and study further in sport. As well as the football in terms, uh, the academic side is really good, I'm currently studying the BTEC diploma here for sport at level 3 and the course is really well run, uh, all the teachers are friendly and uh, it, it works well and coincides well with the academy actually playing football. I'm Jackie Noble, I'm head of post 16 at SCC and I'm here to talk to you about the courses that we run in post 16 that you could study alongside being a member of the Football Academy. We will run a very wide range of BTEC courses, A level courses. You would need to check our website in order to see the wide range of courses that we do study. We look forward to seeing you become a member of SEC Post 16 Centre. My name is Aaron Collins, I'm the Academy Director uh, here at Sittingbourne Community College and basically what my role is, is uh, working between both Sittingbourne Community College and the football club uh, per se. Back in, I don't know, May May 2011 was the first time we kind of came together and it was at that stage when we started forming the relationship. We did some trials um, and we've got the squad that we got, um, a squad of 18 and over the course of the since since about June July we've played a variety of games and um and here we are now back back trialing again um the key thing for me in my role is that the education is paramount is is the key key importance now the reason why it's key importance is because without that um people students won't go on because one of the big objectives for us is that although the kids love their football or the students love their football and they love playing at these places like Bourne Park and all the other non-league places such as Dartford Town, Cray Wanderers, Croydon Athletic, they've played at some fantastic grounds. It is partnering that with the education because my goal as the academy director is to make sure anyone coming into the academy both gets a chance to play for the academy with the potential of going on to the first team and then going on to universities. The trials at the moment we're going through at different stages, different stages of the year. So we've got the first one on the 15th of February. Uh, that will be 3 o'clock to 5 o'clock on the 3G at Sittingbourne Community College. Um, and we're just inviting everyone that thinks they've got the chance or think they should be in the team to have a go. Now that's post-16, current year 12s. Uh, within the school to year 11s, both within this school 
and outside this school as well. 